All right, so we're um, at a reptile zoo. I've only been to regular zoos. I've never been to a specifically reptile one. This is called Prehistoric Adventures Reptile Zoo. It and looks big. We're in Anaheim, California right now. He drove like, well, I drove. <laughs> I, wanted to, I wanted to drive, but it was like, call his car. Don't worry, I got it. And I made sure the seats were comfortable, so I took a good one hour's nap, and they work great. Because I did navigation. I'm good with navigation and stuff, and Rob's really good with the more technical road stuff. Man, I'm pretty excited you guys are here. We're at the Reptile Zoo, and I'm going to show you guys all kinds of crazy animals. See, that's what you want to do, right? That's it. You're going to hold some of them? Yeah, all How about, of them. Okay. I'm ready. All of them. Remember that. All of them. <laughs> that means no nose. It means whatever I pull out, you got to hold. So many exotic animals here that I already see. Whoa! And this is like in some plaza. It's not like in some big old <laughs> zoo. Like there's straight alligators in here. They just chilling up here. So I'm excited to see what we're gonna touch and show. So I always saw this place on Instagram. And now that we're here, this place is like expansive. I just love animals. You know I'm a big animal guy. Did you wear this in the spirit of uh this floral nature? Oh, no, it's us do it after that. was cool. I should have worn something more tropical. What the heck? Is that a dinosaur? It's legit a dinosaur. It's like a, dino it's like a Komodo dragon looking. When would you ever see something like this? Imagine being born into that body. Now, do you think they can go crazy? Like, I'm stuck in this tank all day. Or do they not even know? That is a great question to ask. Bigger animals know like, man, I'm trying to be like, like in the water. But then again, are their brains so small they can't comprehend? I'm trapped. Because okay. you know fish don't. Fish have theoretically no memory. Everything's brand new the second they see it. And then they forget it. And then they forget it. That's like me. The tail's longer than the body. <laughs> Nature is interesting. Oh, this is the one from the show, the Jesse show. The Mrs. Kipling. This is the same. Oh, this, this is, is the nephew of that one. The original one alive, or? Yeah, it's still alive. I might even want to hold the tarantula just for the culture. I hate spiders, so it'd be cool to hold one. <laughs> okay. That's the largest species of the world. Wow. That's terrifying. And yeah. people be holding that? Whoa, that's <laughs> actually huge. <laughs> hold that. You gotta hold that. It's not a wise decision. We're gonna listen to him. It's the first time I ever held one of those. Yeah. They have really big fangs and they have pretty high venom. Bruh. They could really like knock you out, basically. Uh, I mean, I'm gonna kill you, but I guarantee you'll regret it. <laughs> I'll just hold a turtle. <laughs> have you had someone get bitten before? I've been bitten twice. Okay. I got bitten once by a real venomous one. They claim they're one of the worst ones. It got out in my shop, right? And the tarantula guys were scattering like flies. And I'm like, you gotta catch the damn thing and put it away. And it was going into a hole and I stuck my hand there, flipped it up and then went to go put it in the container and it got me. I literally ran to the bathroom, turned the water on super hot and kind of cooked my finger because I figured the venom is some kind of protein and if it's cooked, it ain't gonna kill me, you know what I mean? And it wasn't gonna kill me anyway, but I'll tell you one thing, it didn't feel good. I feel like I'm on like a school field trip again. Okay, you guys, so we probably ought to start with something kind of warm you up. Something not too big, not too crazy. Yeah, and then right? we'll build it up. Right, we'll build it, wrap yeah. it up. Okay. Oh! Let's go here, Fabio, let's go out and play. I think it's a dog. Oh, boy, he's he's getting bigger. But, but this is just a warm up. What um, the heck? This let's see crazy. if he's hungry. So Fabio's an Asian water monitor, and he loves Loves this chicken. Oh, you got yourself a little bit too fat to get off the ground very far. Oh, hey, bro, you're supposed to chew your food. So all you gotta do is make sure he knows that I'm not a piece of chicken. Now he's all cool. I am not a piece of chicken. Oh. Is he cool or what? He's actually shedding his skin. You can see it's falling all off. Probably the coolest thing ever. So we can like hold it. The way it was whipping its tail, I was like. Oh, that he wasn't really whipping his tail. It's just heavy. So he's what he does. My goodness. And it doesn't feel real. The claw is all right. Yeah, he likes you. <laughs> okay, all right. I'm gonna give him back. <laughs> what do you think? We're gonna move to the smaller ones. <laughs> there you go. This is a hefty dude. Oh, yep, the neck. <laughs> That's yep, yep. <laughs> You're my boy. I just wasn't holding you properly. Anybody else jumping in? Uh, I like my face. So. <laughs> <laughs> this is actually a red knee tarantula. And I want to see the toys and stuff that look like that. It's not real. It's got a little battery. So those are fangs right Whoa. there, man. Whoa. That's terrifying. Come on, who's going to put it on their face? Well, the only thing we don't want to do is drop it. So you cannot drop it. I put them on, you got to stay relaxed. I'll take care of the rest. The chances of it biting, what's the probability? One out of ten. Hi. So there's three of you, right? Yeah. So that means you have all. <laughs> 
Seriously, don't let them drop. Well, yeah, now I can't do nothing. Uh, it's going out of my peripheral now. <laughs> Are you out of your comfort zone? We want to get as close as we can to the juggler vein so there's no pain involved. I wish I was never taught fear. The funny part is what you have to worry about, and the hairs have little spikes in them and make you itch really bad. So you should never have them on your neck or face. <laughs> Whoa. Cool, right? Got pretty heavy feet for a little tiny. Oh, no, because he kind of locks each foot down to make the next grab. Oh, it was pretty interesting, too. I'd say he hasn't been anybody <laughs> all month, but he hasn't been held for like a year. Oh, you got to okay. go straight from the juggler. No way. You're there kidding me. <laughs> I can't see your tattoo. All right, I think we're going to grab him now. <laughs> Let's go to the line. Like, <laughs> we'll be right back. It's like you can't even freak out. You're yeah. just in frozen mode. You can't fall, Ryan, so don't move. It looks really cool. Yeah, this is dope. <laughs> Dang, he doesn't want to come off. He's Stop. hanging on. Stop. Real Stop. Stop. That's not funny. <laughs> oh, my God. It was a pleasure meeting you. Thank right, you. Hey, 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 hey. Whoa, 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 whoa. No, yeah, it's it's a, it felt so weird. You can't freak out. Oh. <laughs> Alright, just don't move. Wall is actually really dope. Oh, that's stuff. Oh! Oh! Whoa. Oh! 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 Some exciting animals instead of these little boring ones. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> boring. Boring. You want this? Huh? 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 Come on. You gotta remember these things are capable of cutting Ooh. right through stuff. <laughs> oh, whoa, okay. <clears throat> you don't want this, do you? Okay. Ew. I don't like this song. Okay. So why are some this color and some are green? And Obviously, there's so many kinds of animals. It's, we're still finding new animals that people didn't know. This is a rhino iguana. So this is a green iguana, but it's red. So this, this particular green iguana comes from an area that they're red. What? It's called a rhino iguana. Can we feed the rob iguana next? You want to bite? You want to? He doesn't want to bite. I don't think he wants one. You really do want it? I want to bite. Oh, oh, you See, want to bite? Time. I think I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> I'll show you how sharp his teeth are. I mean, there you go. <laughs> that ripped like some tin foil. Here, this guy's got it. Hello there. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, hey, whoa. <laughs> Only reason why I'm going back is he's got razor blades for claws. Here, you want some food? Oh, you're not going to give me a hickey, are you? Will that freak you out? Yeah. I'm not really gonna jump like that. So in your experience, do animals have personalities? Oh my gosh. As much or more as people. I'll have one snake that I know that I got an attitude, like don't do this or don't do that. Lizards that are like, I'd rather be petted than fed. Got different personalities than people, and got different personalities than animals. There's some personalities that are common for a certain breed of reptile. Like a certain type of snake might have a more aggression than another type of snake. That doesn't mean they're all fallen. Underneath that. Honestly, if you get a wild iguana, they would rip into you. Jolly Green loves bananas. Oh, you're gonna peel it backwards? Oh, he just wants to eat it? No, you don't know. You, you peel a banana, it's supposed to be from this end. You didn't know that? Why do you think it's got a handle? Yeah, give it a little push. There you go. There you go. Got you, buddy. We've had him for about 10 or 15 years, oh. and he was brought this big to me. I basically rescued him. He was really grumpy, but after we hand fed him for a while, he turned into a big teddy bear, and he's pretty cool. How do you get these critters and reptiles and stuff? Is there like a website or an Amazon well, reptile? I mean, honestly, that? you can buy a lot of reptiles online with a lot of different kinds. Some of the things here, because I have a zoo, people will sometimes bring them in because they just can't oh. take care of them anymore. Sometimes we breed a lot oh, of the no. big snakes. Sure. All the big snakes here have pretty much been born in captivity right here. Yeah, you got your Ooh. back right there. Well, that was the jump. When it jumped out and jumped on me, I didn't really care about the guana jumping on me, but I knew there was no way its claws were clipped. Their claws are made to climb trees 60 yeah. feet high. They could drop 40 feet from the air, run on the ground, and just take off running. And he's going to take a little, just a bite. <laughs> Oh, he <laughs> Hello. Good enough. So you want to hold a bearded dragon? Well, the way you preface that, now it's like, okay, well, this is going to bite me or something. Well, they're dragons. I went to Drexel <laughs> University, home of the dragons. <laughs> so, there you go, you're dialed, bro. So I'm good to go. So, oh. They're pretty cool. They come from Australia. That's the beard. See, that kind of hangs, and if they get upset, well, these guys get jet black and bob their heads to scare each other off. So the fact that these are popular pets means that they're, they're more docile. Oh, they're that. very docile. It's really rare to have one that's not mellow. There you go. Wow. I like oh, yeah. his little double chin thing. Yeah. Whoa. <laughs> he just ripped that. <laughs> My man breathing heavy. You ever been on a YouTuber before? Have you all ever played the game Frogger? This yeah. is actually the guy. Dude, this is the guy from the thing. It is so nice to meet you. Look how this one's just chilling though with his arms crossed. Oh, he just hopped on the phone. It's a pixie frog. Are oh. these frogs friends or are they, no, do they not like each other? Oh, that will eat that. Bro, oh, that's slimy. He'd be eating good. He don't miss a meal. He has one eye open. Look at that. Fetty walk. Gross. 
and you wonder what they're thinking right now. Oh. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, 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 no. <laughs> it's doing something. It's going back to the owner. Something got on me. What is that? I'm just chilling. I've never heard the Darth Vader turn. Bro, he breathing up here. We're doing the snakes now. There should be some of my old high school friends in these uh, exhibits over here, so we're gonna go do that. I didn't find your ex. I think that was the first one we held, but yeah, let's go do it. You guys wanna hold it? Rattlesnake? Yeah. Don't they bite? Uh, he hasn't bit anybody ever. Let's do it. <laughs> nah! Well, I didn't sign papers or nothing. We'll start you off with a medium snake. That's okay. Amazing. This is a red tail boa, which is kind of a pretty popular pet, to be honest. Oh, hello. Go ahead, jump in there. What are you running from? The funny part is, is I don't use boas for the parties and stuff, but sometimes they bite. Uh, okay. they randomly lose their cool. They do? They call them common boas or Colombian red tail boas because of their bright, nice, beautiful tail. The python lays eggs. This one has live babies. That's one of the major difference between a boa and a python. These are called constrictors, this but really so every cool. single snake that's not venomous, almost every one of them constricts. You're doing great. You're having a good time. Don't squeeze his neck. Okay, so I always want to make sure you're having fun and the snake's having fun. Oh, and they bite randomly once in a while. I'm not kidding. That's the funny part. She's trying to come to me because she feels safe. Uh, right. She's kind of wrapping on me to hang on. See how tight that end is? Because she's trying to grip. He left. See you a lot. Okay. <laughs> Look at that. He's grabbing on my shirt. He's constricting a little. He went through the buttons. You need to unbutton this. <laughs> She's yeah. taking off my clothes. We just met. I'm just gonna work here if YouTube doesn't work. My face starts turning purple. <laughs> Most of the snakes I have are mellow. Keyword mellow. Doesn't mean they don't have a bad day. Some of my snakes are teddy bears. So at the end of the day, what we're gonna get is one that's mellow. Ah, I see. But it's very big, mellow. It ain't a llama, so. Her sister's almost ripped my head off three times. Okay. What the heck? <laughs> is that the llama still in there? Llama, llama. I hope he's kind of giving a look like she... Okay. Let me take care of the head. So how does it... It comes out in what? All mushed up or what? Oh, like a loaf of bread. Really? Oh, oh, oh. So you see? So you see this right here? Oh, hell no. Yeah, the... Whoa, whoa, whoa. She's grumpy. If I reach straight in right now, she's gonna bite me. I gotta just kind of handle her a little bit. Come on, 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 come on. So if you're wondering why I pick up a foot, that leather shoe is a lot safer. Okay. Go ahead, jump in here, guys. Where are you guys going? Hey. Whoa. Hey. Hello. Hey, hello. Everybody on this side of the snake. This is my favorite part. Oh, you stay. Oh, yes. Stay over there. Oh, me? Okay. Oh. So that's what happens when you get bit. You didn't see it happen, I did saw. you? You did? Yeah. Hey. See? <laughs> the hat are all mellow, everything all good, but then we just played around. No, we're all above her, right? So when she's a little baby, birds come down and eat them. That's what they're scared of. Program their head. I'll pick up the head, and you guys all pick her up at the same time, okay? Nobody run away. If I tell you, watch out, then leave. You mellowed me out. Exactly. Everybody relax. We got this. Look, I got this. See? So I'm going to have to mellow her back out. Uh, yeah, I'm calm right now. So, pick up over there. She can't reach you. See, she's still being a little bit nervous. Come on. Oh, oh. Smokes. Is she heavy? Is she heavy? What's wrong, guys? Pick her up. There you go. How's this, guys? Is that a big snake? So anyway, this is a big reticulated python, largest snake in the world. Not this particular snake, but I'm it's strong. getting close. That's a llama? Sure. That's a llama. I got the llama. The llama is literally in my hands. That's not a llama. That's a poop. That won't work out. That's a loaf of bread. If you guys ever get bored and want to check out some cool content... Nope, I can't do it. I know you're not going to get bored watching these guys, but anyway, my stuff's Jay at Prehistoric Pets. So these guys here are a little bit crazy. I normally let my visitors feed them, but on today we're not good because the last time he literally dove out, ended up on the ground, almost bit my leg. The idea is you got to stay back a couple feet. They're no longer an endangered species and I'll show you why they're not endangered anymore. This is why they're not endangered. Whoa! <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's coming oh hey, it is wanting to jump out. Come on, back up. Oh, oh man! That would hurt. What do you think? Yeah. <laughs> I got one more thing. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh. Hey, you be nice. Come on. Whoa, whoa. Hey. Whoa, buddy. There you go. There you go. Okay. So, we're living the dream, guys. <laughs> whoa, hey, you gotta go back in. Back in. Whoa, 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 buddy. Yeah, let's keep them in there. I think yeah. we're gonna yeah. start this right <laughs> now. <laughs> and this is about the end of the video, guys. I hope you had an awesome day. You guys having a good time or what? Great, no, that was cool. That was good, crazy stuff. Okay, so I've always wanted to say this. See you later, alligator. Don't forget when we do that, bro. Let's go. That was a cool ass.
this experience. I put a spider on my face today. Who would have known? That was fun. Thank you for having us. Really appreciate you guys coming. So what city is this in? Anaheim? This is actually Fountain Valley, California. So if you guys are in the area, come over here. It's actually really cool. There's a lot of stuff to look at and hold and love live server proof. So. We call it living the dream. Living the dream. That's what we're trying to do. <laughs> love living the dream. <laughs>